The Digu DCK3 3D LED wall clock. It's got a base on it and it can go in 24 hour time and the box makes it look a lot better than it is. And I got this off of uh, banggood.com. Yes, it's a real site. And um, we'll open it up. I'm taking a look at it. That's about it. This is going to replace the clock in my kitchen because that clock just just not working out. I just want something easy to read. And as soon as you see that, you say, "Why? Wow, that's not easy to read at all. It's 8888 all the time. But, it's got a battery for backup, so that's kind of nice. DC, 5 volts, USB of course, so going to need one of those. And the base here can, I believe it comes off somehow. There's a couple clips there, so that comes off and it can be wall mounted, exactly what I need. So let's plug it in and see what happens. We're going to go from 8888 to... Oh! Actually is quite readable after all! Not bad! <laughs> okay, um... Mode, now it's alarm mode. Alarm off, I guess. That's brightness three brightness settings. It'll be left at the highest one. And now I think we can set the time. I'll just say like 12... Does it increment if you hold it? It does. It even goes fast. Say 1220. Hit mode and that's it. So that's your colon and I guess the PM itself lights up when it's there. So let me come back and show you. Of course it's 1550 in the washimatory because that's the reverse image. And still very readable. Really readable. The camera kind of washes it out. And if I turn that back on and come back further. Yep, definitely with this kind of distance away, I can make that out no problem. So that will do just perfectly fine. I like it. Uh, apparently it's got an alarm. You, you heard it beep before. Wow. It does 24 hour time, which is explained in the thing. And I don't know if it has any other features and stuff like that. I guess probably not. Mm, oh, it has a night mode also, where after a certain time, it will automatically dim the display. So I may have it do that in the overnight hours, so it doesn't have to burn out the LEDs as fast. Uh, yeah, that's it. I mean, it's a basic thing. The story with this goes, I saw it. It was on sale at Banggood, and I said, Oh, oh, I want that, I want that. But I didn't end up buying it. And the window on my computer stayed open with the intent that I'll buy it in a couple days, I'll see, I still have to justify it to myself. And lo and behold, it was no longer on sale, so I missed out. So I'm not going to buy it at full price, so I just waited and waited and waited and it came back on sale and I bought it. So now I have it and this will eventually make its way to the kitchen. I do need to find a uh, couple of extensions to make this work. I just, why can't they just fucking include power cords with things anymore? I don't know. But anyway, I think it was like eight or nine bucks, something like that. It was actually US shipping, but only for the special sale that I got. Regular price might be 12, 13 bucks, something like that. So while it looks not terribly readable, and that's what you'll see on the website, as you saw, it is quite readable, and I like that kind. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. Take care. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.